Hey guys, I'm Drea Renee for Poker Central, bringing you the 411 on the top nine players at the 2017 World Series of Poker main event. Let's take a closer look at Englishman John Hest, who's made quite the impression with his funky fashion. John hails from Bridlington, England, and owns a company that rents caravan vacation homes. The father of four and grandfather of seven has been a recreational player for about 20 years and only plays about once a month in his home casino, Napoleon's, in Hull, England. He only has a little more than 2,000 in tournament earnings and now his Hindu mob will have another million added to his name. Hesp has made quite the impression in his colorful jacket and Panamanian hat. He said, would you like to borrow my jacket and shirts to go for it? And I said, oh sure Dave, why not? Never thinking anything of it. Right. The day before I was due to fly, he brought them round, laundered, ironed, on hooks, so there you go. The wardrobe became his lucky charm and made for some exciting views for the poker fans. As a former salesman, Hess says he can get a read off some players from body language and communication. And in an age where math plays such a big role, he relies on intuition and feel. A key hand for Hess on the bubble of the main event came when his queen seven of clubs flopped a flush and beat Oliveira's top two pair, taking down a massive pot worth 33 million in chips. Ace or nine for Oliveira, it's the eight of clubs, so Oliveira is gone, Hess with the knockout. Hess says it's not really about the money for him, it's more about the challenge. He says his experience at the main event has been indescribable, unbelievable, surreal, and phenomenal. He's just living the dream. Good luck to you, John Hess. It looks like you have some money now to buy some more funky jackets. We wish you well here at Poker Central. Make sure to follow all the coverage on PokerCentral.com and all the live action on Poker Go. I'm Drea Renee, and that's the 411.